Hi, I'm glad you could join me tonight for prayer. Tonight we're in Matthew 6 still, and we're on verses 16 through 18. And whenever you fast, do not look dismal like the hypocrites, for they disfigure their faces so as to show others that they are fasting. Truly I tell you, they have received their reward. But when you fast, put oil on your head and wash your face so that your fasting may be seen not by others, but by God who is in secret. And your God who is in secret will reward you. So I invite you to close your eyes and take a deep breath. And I want you to think about a time when you had hunger pains, when you were hungry for food, when you're hungry for justice. I invite you to breathe in and to let your breath go and to think about time, a time when you were hungry. Jesus, we don't like to fast. We don't fast. Unless it's part of a new diet trend that's supposed to improve our health. Even during Lent, which just ended, we don't really fast anymore. We may give up chocolate or Twitter or coffee or red meat on Fridays. Yet you invite us to a discipline of fasting. Not for others to, to see, but to strengthen our relationship with you. We are to fast so that you know we are trying to draw closer to you, to be more connected and to learn from those pangs of hunger. But we also know that hunger, the pang of hunger, are very real for too many people. Too many children do not have enough food to survive, let alone thrive. We have too many people having to make choices where food may come after paying rent or paying medicine. Hunger pains are too real. Be with those who are hungry. If you are able, lead them to a place where food is available. If there's no place to get food, help a person who can bring aid, learn of the need and do something. We also ask you to be with those who see hunger strikes as the only way to get the attention of the powerful. Be with those using hunger strikes to change hearts and minds. God, we know you have called us to fast differently. That in Isaiah, you invite us to fast not as a practice of giving up food, but as a practice to transform the world with love. You invite us to fast by loosening the bonds of injustice, by letting the oppressed go free, by sharing our bread with the hungry, by bringing the homeless poor into our houses, by covering the naked, and by not hiding ourselves from our kin. God, help us learn to fast. Fast in ways that bring us closer to you. And while we're here with you in this moment of prayer, or while we're here with you trying to draw closer, we ask you to be with those who are on our hearts and in our minds. We ask you to be with our friends and family who are sick and ill. We ask you to be with those who are struggling with chronic illness. We ask you to be with those who've been infected with COVID. We ask you to be with those who are grieving, grieving the loss of the ones they love. God, we ask you to draw close to us, to surround us with your love, to show us the way that we can draw closer to you. Amen.